The stadium is buzzing already and with good cause. Two top sides ready to go at it. And this should be something special on the pitch. Well, this wonderful city offers the visitors so much, including football. Barcelona, of course. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Barcelona, and they take on Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. Can he finish? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. take it short and it's played into the center and the keeper getting across to stop it keen to take it short here Robert Lewandowski in the middle now well, the ball goes out of play for what will be a goal kick Robert Lewandowski is one of those natural finishers and could be a big part of the story today, Stuart. Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique and awareness. He will certainly need to be tightly marked today. It needs an accurate cross. And that is not going to help the cause. The header well off the mark. Kamavinga is with Vinicius Junior. Modric unable to hang on to the ball. Carvajal. Incisive pass. And a goal! 1 0. And what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, here we can see it again. It's a lovely ball in behind, perfectly timed. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Well, I love the celebration, but Ancelotti's got to get his players refocused now. Well, back underway here. What sort of response will that goal elicit from Barca? Rafinha. He's beaten his man. Well, got there in the end. That's the important thing. And he's through here. The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing. And now they sense victory. Well, here it is again. And it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And the ball is moving again. 2 0 is how it stands. And very nicely positioned to win it back. Eduardo Camavinga. And Bellingham. Carvajal. Will he play it in? And a goal! It's a finish of real class. No shortage of acrobatics on display here. He's judged it to perfection. Incredible header. Well, here's the replay, and as you can see, Carvajal's cross was always going to be threatening, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. 
Well, on they go again. And Real very much in control. Rafinha. Might work out. A goal! He's dispatched it, much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, as you can see, what an excellent backfield this is to set up the goal. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. So back underway at 3-1. Camavinga. Aurelien Chouameni. Here's Carvajal. Went in strongly, decisively. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Vinicius Junior. And return to Rodrigo. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Can he finish? And what a magical save it was! Corner kick played in. It might still be problematic. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. De Jong. And Barcelona finding space on the flank. Pressing really high. Vinicius Junior. Plenty of support here. But they dealt with the threat posed. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Romeo. Lewandowski now. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Felix. Can he get one back? Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Oh, super piece of play. Well, then there to tidy up. Well, credit to the goalkeeper because that was a terrific save just to keep their two-goal lead here. And Bellingham. Surely! And there is the goal! He's found the net! Joy unconfined! Well, just look at the bend he puts on this. It's good technique and perfect placement. That's a top quality finish. Well, no wonder Ancelotti's delighted. They're bossing the game now. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Joao Felix. De Jong. Needs to clear it away. But tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Vinicius Junior. Good work from Barcelona to win it back. Oh, good-looking run. That's a nice-looking ball. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. And over comes the corner. Well, no end product. Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Woo! Well, 
Well, here it is again, and you have to say it's the perfect delivery into the danger area. And then the finish from Gundogan was never in doubt. He's such a good technician. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Joao Felix. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. Played into the center. Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. And eventually into the grateful grasp of the keeper. Well, that could have gone anywhere once it hit the woodwork, but they've got away with it here. Bellingham. Here's Valverde. Rudiger. And with that, the first half draws to a close. And I must say, Vinicius Junior really giving an excellent account of himself. He's been very hard to play against. Well, he scored good goals, but his all-round play has been excellent. He looks like scoring every time he gets on the ball. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. High quality defending. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. A really good pass. Could play it in. What an important piece of defending. Joao Cancelo. Barca know it's a sector of the pitch devoid of defenders. Chances on. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Federico Valverde. Eduardo Camavinga. Felix. Might be a chance here. Must be. And that's a very good parry. Corner for Barcelona. And a double substitution it's going to be. Short corner taken. Oh, and it goes! Another goal! And I'll tell you what, the impossible is becoming quite possible. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal.
Carvajal. Jose Lu. And a good looking ball. Well, he so badly wanted to net another one, but the keeper playing his part. Well, maybe that should have been his second, but you can see another one coming. He's playing so well here. Trying to pick out a teammate. And that is a defender doing his job, clearing it off the line. And the danger is averted. And into the last 30 minutes now. Joao Cancelo. Torres. This could be the equaliser. But oh, what an important save. How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. They favoured a short one here. And a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? A good and fair challenge. Difficult to stop him. And it's played into the centre. It's a great goal. Well, you don't get too many score lines like this one. 4-4. Four, four. Tony Kors. Well, a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Vinicius Junior. And Bellingham. And he might be through here. And a goal! Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. Well, he can't control his delight, can he? It's a wonderful moment for his team. Say I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. But quick thinking defensively. 20 minutes to go in this one. Real chance. Magnificent from Marc-Andre Ter Stegen. Romeu, Joao Cancelo, Pedri, De Jong, it's with Joao Cancelo, chance to play it in, and thumped away. Jose Lu. What can Real do from this position? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Can he finish? And putting his body on the line. And the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. Playing it short. And a useful cross. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. And the clearance there means a corner. Well, opting for the short corner. 
And the goal it is for Real Madrid. They are on a victory course. Well, here it is again, and they go short just to get a different angle on the cross, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Well, that's just what Ancelotti wanted. He has to be happy with this performance from his team. And if you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. Rafinha. Here's Carvajal. And the pass deftly cut out. Rafinha. Torres. Superbly read and executed. This might be ideal for the counter. Can they make it count? Well, it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Oriol Romeu. Now with De Jong. This is looking threatening. Cancelo. On to De Jong. Kunde. Now with De Jong. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. In with a chance. Not on the target, and who knows, that might very well be that. Well, that's a bad miss, and probably ends their hopes here. Torres. It's with Joao Cancelo. Can he convert? And the referee says that will do it. It's the end of the game and it's a victory for Real Madrid. Their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield and they created chances as well. It was a great performance. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.